Hey everyone, Digital David here. Today in this video, I'm gonna be unboxing and reviewing the Apple Mac Mini. I did purchase this product myself and any opinion expressed in this video is strictly my own. That being said, if you're interested in this product, you wanna find out more about it, the link to it will be in my video description below. Please go ahead, check it out and do your shopping from there. You can see how it comes packaged to you in a nice and simple retail box. I really have always liked Apple's product packaging. We can learn about the product on the backside so we can see the model number and the specs. This is a late 2018 Mac mini with Intel's i3 8th gen processor, giving us four cores at 3.6 gigahertz with eight gigabytes of DDR4 RAM and 128 gigabyte SSD. Now that's on the small end. This is the base specs for the Mac mini and you can definitely tech inspect them out. I'd like to see like 256 gigabytes as the smallest capacity, 128 gigs is just not that much space, but there's a bunch of IO on here so we can plug in external drives and even an external GPU if we want. I actually bought this product on Facebook Marketplace and decided to do this video because the seller included it in its retail box and packaging. Let me know in the comment section below if you have a Mac, which year and how much did you pay for it? I can't wait to hear from you guys. Also, let me know what you think about this. This is the base model again, and it's on the weaker side of the specs, at least compared to PC and building your own, but this is the cheapest barrier of entry into the Apple Mac OS world, and I need to have that for some future videos I'll be doing on my channel. I review a software called MacPaw on my channel that helps clean your Mac. It's a really helpful software, and I need a Mac to showcase it properly. So be sure to check out that video on my channel. I'll have a code to that in my video description below too if you're interested in cleaning your Mac. So that being said, got it on Facebook Marketplace. Why I picked this specific Mac versus all the other Macs out there is because I needed 4K support. So I was looking at like a 2015 used iMac and then 2016, obviously anything newer that supported 4K or the 2018, late 2018 Mac minis that have 4K resolution that's supported. So I landed on this one and I got a great deal on it. I paid $565 for this Mac. So I'm really excited to open up and see the package contents. So let's go ahead, let's do that now. Here are all the package contents. First up we have your user guide right here. It's literally one page, just showing you the product features and details. They have more information on the back if you need more help and support. Next we have your compliance guide. Then we have your Apple stickers. I love that they still include these all these years later. These look identical to the first stickers I ever got with my iPod mini. Then we have your power cable right here in black. It looks really nice. I'd say it's around six feet in length, give or take a couple inches. And then last but not least, we have the Mac mini itself. Looks really cool. So love seeing the Apple logo on there and we have it in space gray. Now let's look at it in more detail. The space gray is a really nice feature. I love how everything looks with the rounded edges and it's just so lightweight and compact. I'm a big fan too of the shiny Apple logo at the top. I love that it's reflective. I'm feeling a little bit nostalgic holding this Mac mini because I had the original Mac mini. So I always like to look for a disc drive but obviously you can tell there's no disc drive right here. There's actually nothing on the left or the right side at all. It's not till we get to the back side that we see all the ports that we have. Power button, where we connect our power cord, ethernet port. We have four USB type C Thunderbolt 3 ports. We have an HDMI port, two USB ports, and a headphone jack. And then you can see we have our ventilation right here for the Mac. We can flip it over to the bottom. You can see it says Mac mini right here. We can actually remove this cover if we want to upgrade the RAM. So that's a big change from the previous year where we couldn't upgrade the RAM anymore. Unfortunately, you still can't upgrade the SSD. So whatever hard drive you select straight from the factory, that's what you're gonna get by default. So unfortunately, there's nothing we can really do there. But again, you had those ports on the back so we could add some more storage externally. Same with the GPU. We could add an eGPU if we want using the ports on the back side. But overall guys, this is really cool. I'm really happy with how big it is in the size form factor. Obviously I bought the base specs. It's gonna be good enough for what I need online. I'll be sure to follow up in the future with another video, let you guys know how it holds up long term. And if I do decide to edit some videos on it or any sort of heavy intensive work, but basically this is just gonna be used for screen capturing and filming tutorial videos for Mac Paw software and other software that's Mac specific. Don't forget the link to that is in my video description below too if you need to get 
your Mac cleaned, you're gonna check out that software. So overall guys, I'm really excited that the Mac mini become part of my toolkit. I'm underwhelmed by the features, but depending on your budget, you can really max and spec this thing out. I'm disappointed that I only have 128 gigabytes of storage and it's not upgradable, but I am pleased that I have so many ports on the backside that I can expand the storage externally. I really, really, really wish they included a keyboard and a mouse because I want the full Mac OS experience and I'm only a PC guy, so I only have my PC keyboard and mouse. Nothing wrong with that because I bought the Mac mini specifically to save money. I didn't wanna pay for a display or anything else like that that I don't need, but it would be nice if they did include that to make this even a better value. Well, that concludes our video. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget the product link will be in our video description below. Please go ahead, check it out and do your shopping from there. Any purchase made through that link helps support our channel at no additional cost to you. So we're really grateful and thankful for all of your support. While you're at it, can you go ahead and hit that like button for us? and subscribe to our channel. We have new content coming out daily and we don't want you to miss anything. Please go ahead and give us a follow online and make it a clean sweep. Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Twitch, TikTok, Discord. You can message us on WeChat, check out our website and join our free newsletter. Thank you guys so much for being here. Don't forget new content daily and we can't wait to see you in our next video.